start for the University of Michigan women's soccer team. They are unbeaten in Big Ten play after the first four matches. So we bring in the head coach, Jen Klein. And, and coach, talk about the start of conference play. What is the secret to your success here so far? No, I think the girls are just confident. Uh, they're really excited with the start of Big Ten. Uh, we always talk about uh, finish, uh, start fast and finish strong. And uh, they definitely have grabbed a hold of that motto and are uh, carrying it through along the way. We well, certainly would like to finish strong and, and win a Big Ten <laughs> championship, right? So how do you sustain this? And what is the ingredient of this team that actually makes it capable of winning a Big Ten title this year? Yeah, I think a big thing is our, our motto this year is make it, make it Michigan. So it's all about reminding them just the, the habits that we want to establish um, within the program that's going to allow for them to uh, stay focused and disciplined. Um, it's still a very long season with a lot of games left. So just enjoying every step of the way whilst uh, keeping a, a bigger picture in mind as we go game to game throughout the season. Give me an example of, of one of those things that make it Michigan. Uh, it's just, you know, discipline in, in our defending. I think that's a big thing that we've really tried to focus on this year. Um, I've been really happy with the group, just our, our commitment to be good 1v1 defenders, but also uh, just being a good defensive team and, and working hard to keep the ball at the back of the net. I, I think our goalkeeper, Hillary Beal, has done a great job of helping us do that. Um, and then also moving forward uh, on the attacking side, uh, just making sure that we value the ball, we move it really quick, and then finish our chances. Well, you mentioned a, a couple of players, and in particular your goalkeeper, who had some incredible uh, saves, especially down the stretch against Penn State. And, and you beat a ranked Penn State team. That's coming off of beating a ranked Washington State team, part of this six-match unbeaten streak. In particular, with those two wins against those ranked opponents, what did you see from your team? What did you learn from your team? No, I just learned that our team is uh, very, very focused and, and they want to accomplish something this year. I mean, they came into the season with a goal of winning a championship. And so our staff is just working really hard to help them achieve that goal. But I think what I've learned from the group is just, uh, you know, their ability to score goals, but then also their ability to be disciplined um, and, and work hard defensively uh, and fight till the very, very end. Uh, we played two very difficult teams that challenge us in different ways. I mean, Washington State had uh, an attacking threat uh, that just came at us, and we were able to sustain that pressure throughout throughout the game. And then Penn State is just a great team, very well coached, um, and we were able to stay organized and be good through the ebbs and flows of the game as they had momentum and the momentum shifted. So I just think the, the group is showing some maturity um, and some confidence. Okay, so you coach for a living, but that means you also have to recruit for a living. So if you're yeah. trying to recruit Wolverine women's soccer fans, I want you to finish this sentence for me you have to watch blank player because of her blank yeah I think you really need to watch Nikki Hernandez I mean her work rate on both sides of the ball really gives our team's ability to be dangerous um, I mean she's a, a player that can go box to box um, and work extremely hard uh, she's very very selfless um, she's a player that you know isn't getting uh, the actual like stats as far as the assists and the goals, but everything that she's doing allows for a Sarah Stratagakis, a Meredith Hawkinson um, to be successful. And so I, I think she's a player for definitely to watch. Okay, well, those players on Thursday night, a big battle between two of the Big Ten unbeatens. What needs to happen against Wisconsin? Yeah, we just got to come in with a ton of energy and know that Wisconsin is going to bring it as well going into their um, into their home. Uh, but I think we just need to make sure that we value the ball, keep good possession, and when we get our opportunities, make sure we put them in the back of the net. Okay, well, Coach Klein, thank you. And, of course, you can watch that Wisconsin-Michigan matchup right here on BTN. Thank you. Thank you very much. Go Blue.